Hello and welcome. This is Rufal Monger, my friends. We have some pretty big news on the Melty Blood type Lumina front. One, we're getting two new DLC characters and an all new stage. And more importantly, those DLC characters are coming out completely free of charge. Yes, zero dollars. Also, very soon, as they launch January the 13th, that's not too far away from now. So just who are these characters that we're getting for free? The first is Dead Apostle Noel, and yes, this is the same Noel that's already in the game. So Noel, who was the nun with the spear, she's uh, decidedly much more anime now, let's put it that way. She's now a dead apostle, which effectively is a vampire, I guess you could say that. And she has a whole slew of new powers and moves, so this is a fully unique character. It is indeed Noelle, the same character from before, but a completely different playstyle and move set. Now, as for why she's a lot more colorful and smaller, well, anime is gonna anime. Our second character is a returning Melty Blood veteran, Aoko Aozaki. When Melty Blood launched, a lot of people were pretty put out that she did not make the initial roster, but here she is, and once again, she's free. Also comes with this new stage. She retains a fair bit from the previous Melty Blood, although, once again, this is an all-new game, so she's not exactly the same. She's pretty important outside of the Tsukihime universe, I guess you could say. Uh, she's part of the greater Type Moon universe. She's the one who gave Shiki his glasses. But as far as Tsukihime goes, she's actually most famous for Melty Blood itself. So if you are a big fan of the franchise, we have one of the returning vets. So all in all, pretty great news for Melty Blood type Lumino, getting these new characters and getting them very soon. The original roadmap said we'd have the first two characters this winter, and they've held true to it. And it also said price not set, and turns out the price, well, it's free, so that's pretty good for the price. We do have at least two new characters coming as well on top of these characters sometime later this year. And it feels weird to say this year because it is January 1st right now. But sometime later this year, two more characters. So Melty Blood is far from done just yet. I know they had to be incredibly happy with the initial sales. Melty Blood, when it first launched, was like taking over the Steam charts. It was doing so well. So hopefully that means past these four characters, we'll get even more. So if you have not played for a while, now is a great time to dust off the game. Both characters will be dropping this January 13th. It may or may not come with any balance changes, not sure about that. In the initial roadmap, they did state there would be balance changes with free updates, but I don't know if it's going to be part of this specific DLC launch. That all said, two new characters, that's a lot of content, the price can't be beat. So I would highly suggest you go and check it out. And other than that, my friends, well, that's the end of the video. So thank you very much for watching. Hope this video has found you well and go out and play some Melty Blood.